All right, here we go. Everybody's been talking about the Berkeley Cred. It's been out for a while. So I decided to pick me one up and try it. All it is is a, uh, oh, I'm missing an eye already. All it is is a jerk bait uh, made for forward facing sonar. And if it's just the lip of it, it's turned, it's turned upside down or backwards, however you want to call it. Instead of pointing down, it's pointing up. So when you throw this thing out there, it, when it starts to sink down, it sinks about a foot per second. It starts to sink down, it sinks like this backwards because of the weight transfer system on the inside. So as it sinks down, you know, you're watching it on your forward facing sonar, and then when you jerk it, it comes upward and sinks backwards. Forward and sinks backwards. And you can see that uh, action on your forward facing sonar. Right. So if you compare it to. My normal jerk bait, you can see the difference. See, this is a this is a stunner. This is a crash. Notice the lips coming up, lip going down. Right? So when you need to get down to those fish uh, really fast before they swim off, that crash you get down there to them. Right now, I'm seeing some fish down there about 15 feet and it doesn't take this thing long to get down there. Once I work it, once it gets down there, you don't have to work it down like you do a jerk bait. You just let it sink. Once it gets down there, I start working it up, working it up, and when that, when that fish comes at it, don't don't try to force feed them. Actually, get a little more aggressive with it, like you're trying to get away from it, and uh, they seem to like that. So let's try it. Throw it out there. Locate my fish right out there. And let it sink down to him. When I get to the zone, I'm going to start working. That's how it works, people. Look at that little sucker. <laughs> but, uh, that's your courage. Fish. Let's see, let's see if we can get one bigger. Unfortunately, we're dealing with a bunch of small fish here, but I think you guys get the picture. But next time you're at the tackle shop and you don't have a Berkeley Courage, especially if you're going to be on this uh, spotted bass fishery, I would definitely recommend that.